Well, here we are outside, and here's my greenhouse. It's all built with PVC panels. Um, but there's the solar panels from Harbor Freight. And it's a 100 watt system. I just built a strap in frame for it. It's two by three. Made some quick little brackets to go in the grooves of the PVC panel and mounted them to that. Um, I put all my weight on top of it. I'm a 200 pound person and it held all my weight. It'll easily hold those uh, 15 pounds worth of solar panels and, uh, and any winds we get around here. But uh, I'll go back inside and I'll show you uh, the setup we have going off that 100 watt uh, solar kit. All right, we're back inside the greenhouse. Um, there's the charge controller that comes with the kit from Harbor Freight. Um, this weekend, that whole setup with all these, all the wires, the charge controller, and a couple of cool accessories like the lights. And I'll show you the lights in a minute. If it was, I wish it was nighttime when I was doing this, and maybe I'll even add something to it later. But the two LED lights that come with it are the brightest LEDs, I believe. I've ever seen that go with a solar lighting system and they hardly use any energy. But anyways, I'm up to 14.4 volts. I'm not sure if you can make that out, but um, this charge controller is really simple. Um, you know, I wouldn't call it high end, but it does the job. And uh, for a $189 solar panel kit, um, I think this Harbor Freight kit is incredible. And I actually bought it this weekend, $30 off. They had a three day sale. Um, so start looking for their sales. And like I told you earlier, my uh, entire greenhouse runs off from solar. I have other solar on the property, but this particular system is just for the greenhouse. I also have a Cobra. This is a 2500 watt, um, up to 5000 watt peak. I actually got that from walmart.com. I can run Skillsaw off it. Um, I run a big fan off from it. Um, you can run one power tool at a time. You can run a refrigerator. It's, it's it's not going to run a whole house by, by any means, but it was affordable. I believe I paid about $169 for it or $170, so, somewhere in that, that area or anyways. But it's a pretty cool inverter. Um, never had a problem with it. Had it for over a year now. And then at Harbor Freight as well, they have this 35 amp hour 12 volt battery. I use 6 volt golf cart batteries and I um, I'll link them together to get a 12 volt battery system. And I have them all running. Like I've, It takes a lot to run my other system. But I only have one on this, and this seems to hold up for what, what I need it for. And like I said, it's to run an aerator, and um, I run a fan on it a little bit. I just wanted to show you the LED lights that come with Harbor Freight's solar powered system. The 100 watt solar uh, panel system. It is a little switch in the line, or you can turn it on at the inverter. But this little switch in line works pretty good. As you can see, lights on, lights off. Really simple system. I really like it. At night, there's a ton of light that comes off. There's two of these that comes with the kit. I have a 12 by 24 greenhouse that I'm in right now. And I only use one of these lights to light up the whole thing. It's plenty of light. And it doesn't use much power. Um, right now, I don't know if you can hear it in the background. Got my 12 volt fan running. Um, you can see the holes to the side. And it just, I think it's over 80 degrees in here. And uh, even though it's only 25 degrees outside, I'm at 85 inside just from the sun heating up the greenhouse at 1130 this morning. Uh, it's my temperature regulator. But it's pumping the air out. And this little system, like I showed you with the 100 watt panel, uh, takes care of that. It keeps my greenhouse at the temperature I need it. Here's a quick shot of the fan in my system. Thank you for watching Maine Garden and Homestead. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel.